I'm Jay Desio from DroneWorks. This video covers updating the DJI Smart Controller with DJI Assistant 2 from Mavic to support the DJI Mavic Air 2. Firmware version V01.00.0820. When the Smart Controller is powered on, a message will appear about a new firmware version. This is for an over-the-air update, which this video does not cover. Due to the large size of this update, we do not recommend an over-the-air update. Click Cancel. Before we start the update, we want to change the display sleep timer to prevent the smart controller from going into sleep mode during the update. Click the apps icon in the lower right corner of the display. On the apps page, click the settings icon. Scroll down to the display settings and click on display. Click on the sleep option. Scroll up and change the sleep timer from one minute to never sleep. Press the back button on the upper left hand corner of the remote to return to the apps page. On the PC or Mac, open DJI Assistant 2 for Mavic. Connect the USB-C cable to the USB-C port on the smart controller. When the smart controller recognizes the USB connection to the PC or Mac, a dialog box will appear with three options. Do not select any of the options and do not close the dialog box. A charging speed dialog box will appear. This is normal when not connected to the stock charger. Click OK. The smart controller will appear in DJI Assistant. Click on the icon. A firmware list will show all available firmware versions, including the current version and the new version. The latest version of firmware is version V01.00.0820. Click the Upgrade button. A dialog box pops up as a reminder that during the upgrade, the computer must remain connected to the internet, the smart controller must remain powered on, and the USB connection must be maintained. When ready, click Start Update. The update consists of three parts, downloading, transmitting, and updating. Expect the entire upgrade to take between approximately 15 to 30 minutes, with the determining factor being the speed of the internet connection. During the third part, updating, expect the percentage to pause at 16, 56, and 98%. Be patient, the process will resume. The update process in this video has been accelerated to save time. When the firmware update is complete, the smart controller will reboot. A dialog box about the device connection will appear on the DJI Assistant window. Click the IC button to clear the message and return to the DJI Assistant startup screen. During the smart controller reboot, close DJI Assistant and disconnect the USB-C cable. If left connected, DJI Assistant will attempt to perform the upgrade again once the reboot is complete. After the reboot of the smart controller, the firmware package that was uploaded will be installed. This will take several minutes. Once the firmware package has been installed, the smart controller will reboot again. The smart controller is now upgraded to the newest firmware and includes support for the DJI Mavic Air 2 and the DJI Fly app. The DJI Fly app will start up automatically. Power on the Mavic Air 2 aircraft. On the Smart Controller display, click the Connect button to go to the Aircraft Management screen. On the Smart Controller display, click on the Mavic Air 2. The Smart Controller will start a series of fast beeps and a dialog box will instruct you to press and hold the power button for approximately 4 seconds until the aircraft beeps. 
The dialog box incorrectly states the power button is on the bottom of the aircraft, which is not correct for the Mavic Air 2. The Mavic Air 2 is now bound to the smart controller. A dialog box will prompt for the aircraft name. The default name, Mavic Air 2, will already be in the name field. Accept the default or enter a different name, then click OK. DJI Flywheel initialize for the first time and then prompt for the information required by all DJI flight apps. Answer the questions, enter an email address and password of an existing DJI account or create a new one. If you want to skip the new user guide for now, click skip in the upper right hand corner of the display. An image of a Mavic Air 2 will appear on the screen. Click Go Fly to enter the flight app. A dialog box will ask you to enable the AirSense system. This will enable notifications of manned aircraft nearby. It is highly recommended to enable the safety feature. The smart controller is now ready for the first flight of the Mavic Air 2. Before the first flight, take a couple of minutes to review the on-screen settings and controls. Safe flying.